What's up guys, my name is Sharky Cello and I'm back here again, pretty much with another Perfecting the Ojama video, but um, this is more of a teach you guys why I don't run certain cards in the Ojama deck. First of all, I gotta show you my my three rapist Ojamas, you know, they're gonna rape you, look at that, <laughs> they're gonna rape you, <laughs> I love this, I love those. Um, okay, before we get started. Uh, I've been saying that Ojamas are not, um, well, there there are an OTK deck, but they're not, you know, strictly OTK. It's just like, um, what do you call it, wind-ups. Everybody thinks wind-ups are just, oh, hand loop, hand loop, hand loop, just like M. Cole 40 said. If you haven't seen that video, I will link you down below. But uh, he said that, uh, I like the way he thinks because he says that uh, uh, people call my decks bad because I'm not playing the way it's supposed to be played or whatever. And like he said, there's two different kinds of people. One that think the deck should be run this way, and another one that thinks uh, innovatively, you know, creates the deck, uh, adapts to the format. And that's what I do. I adapt to the format, and I do not keep the same thing over and over. Like, um, back in the days, the wind-up hand loop was amazing. Now, it sucks, because priority's gone, Valor's is very rampant, uh, Phoenix Chain can destroy you, decks like rabbit first turn rabbit uh you're fucked you can't do anything and uh yeah they have to adapt so he adapts into a style where well um let me use my uh let me use my other monsters that are supposed to be for the hand loop and use that to get advantage with the monsters you know like get other big exceed monsters out and this is why uh i do with ojamas i mainly use them to beat down my opponent and not to uh mainly i I mainly use it to beat down and control my opponent. That's what I use Ojamas for. I I do do the OTK. That is my second option if I really need to do it. Um, I'll do it. But the reason why I don't run the OTK because, like I said, um, with windups, when you uh, try to do the hand loop, one one good Valor, you're fucked. You you automatically lose. Just scoop. Same thing with Ojamas. One good. Uh, yeah, you summon red, summon all your things, you know, summon all this. Um, you're about to play your, you're about to play your Delta Hurricane, the MST, before you even play it and destroy your, <laughs> your country. Yeah, you play it, but uh, your country's destroyed. You can't, you know, go into that big ass damage. Yeah, maybe they'll exceed into Gachi Gachi or whatever, and you will stall and all this other good stuff, but they will come back. Like, for example, Chaos Dragon, summon Chaos Sorcerer, summon Black Cluster Soldiers, summon Light Pulsar Dragon, summon this, summon that, banish your gachi gachis, do this, do that, do this, do that, and then <laughs> rape you. And that's why the OTK is not really a good option in the deck. Okay, guys, um, since that's out of the way, like I said, OTK option, not a good, don't run more than one of these, only run one. Uh, it's a really bad card, really bad card to draw. Only run one of him. Uh, he's only there if you need to exceed, need to draw. I mean, not to that, not to draw. Need to exceed, and if you can go for the OTK. Same thing with Delta Hurricane. Only run one of that. That's the pure best. Let me show you. Let me show you guys what is the best. You know. Okay, you gotta run one of this. I'm not gonna show you my deck. Just, let me show you the best. Uh, combination of Ojama cards you need to run. I should have done this earlier. But, uh, okay, there it goes. And one more card. There we go. Okay, guys. Let me show you. This is the formula you need to run. Okay, one Hurricane, of course. Uh, one Magic, because you don't want to draw that shit. You need to run your three uh, Country, because that's what the deck runs around. You need to run your uh, two of each Vanilla because your vanillas are what, you know, give you your power. It's like a um, running rescue rabbit deck where they have to run their uh, three Kabasus and their three um, Sabersaurus. Same with this, you know, run all of that. This and, of course, your red. So that's the best formula, guys. Don't run any more than this. Only run your three red, your uh, six vanillas, your three countries. Only one of this because this card is... Unless you're running... Um, uh, the nine Ojamas, then don't run one of these. And uh, this. Don't run another one of those. 
And of course that. So how many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Only run 15 Ojama cards. Yes. That's all you need. Okay, guys. Um, Ojama Trio. Why the hell would you run this in Ojamas? I know there's a really good combo where you play Ojama Trio. And then you play, um, what's that card called? Uh, crap. Uh, super polymerization. That is really awesome. You get out your, uh, I used to play that back in the days. Where you play this, super poly, get into your, to your, um, uh, what's it called? To your king, and then just go ape shit on them. But, uh, I don't do that because, uh, it's a very slow, 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 you know, play to do, and decks nowadays need to be very explosive and very controlling. That's why I don't do that. <laughs> um, oh yeah, here we go. This card is what really pisses me off, and tell me, people tell me to play it. Try white. Don't get me wrong, this card is freaking amazing. It's good. But, you need to run bad cards in order for this card to work. Let me, let me tell you what this card does. Let me read it to you guys. Let me zoom in. Okay, target three level two or lower normal type monsters in your graveyard. Special summon them from your graveyard. That's very good. You know, go for your OTK and all this other good stuff. But, here's the problem. You need to run nine of each. You need to run uh, three of each vanilla monsters. You know, you need to run two of these. You need to run two of these. You need to run, you know, cheap cards in order for this card to work. And it's not really that good. And like I said, this card is only for the OTK. You know, you play this card, you get out your Jamas. Uh, they Trento Tribute your ass. You're like, oh, sad face. This card is good, but it's, at the same time, it's not good. And then it takes forever for it to set up. I mean, it, it, it's kind of bad. Don't run it. And last but not least, this card. Destiny Hero Defender. A lot of people tell me to play this card. And I just, oh my god, I want to slap him in the face. What kind of advantage do you get out of this card? What kind? None. All you get is a 2700 beater. And what if... And then you go attack, chain MST, battle phase, destroy country. Oh, sad face, it's destroyed. <laughs> and uh, if you need to go defensive, it gives your opponent pluses. Come on, they get to draw a card just because you want this card and your deck to have a 2700 beater. Come on, guys, don't be bad like that. And uh, yes, guys, that is my little tiny rant. Actually, a fucking long ass rant about Ojamas. <laughs> But yes, I uh, hope you guys take this uh, video in consideration. I hope it helps you a lot more when it comes to playing Ojamas. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys have very fun playing this deck because it's really fun. And especially when you learn how to use the deck and learn how to adapt with the deck and learn that the deck is not pure. Blah, blah, and learn that the deck is not pure OTK. You have to go for the OTK. No. You play other cards like Junk Synchron. Let me show you. You play other cards like Junk Synchron. You play cards like Instant Fusion to control your opponent, Junk Synchron to get over, you know, things like Logia, play your Diabloses, play Chaos Sorcerer, you know, stuff like that uh, to help your deck out. I mean, the deck revolves around Ojama Blue and getting pluses off of it, you know, trying to control your opponent. Don't let OTK get to you because if they fuck up your OTK, you pretty much need to scoop already because you lost. So uh, that's pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. Peace. I hope you guys enjoy this video. This video is very long, and I hope it's very informative. And if you have any questions, please leave them down below. And uh, that's pretty much it, ladies and gentlemen. Peace, and I'm done. Thanks, guys, and uh, don't play Rescue Rabbit. Link you to a video down below. Bye.